Thursday morning walkabout and your boy's gonna rant a little bit this morning. I read an interesting article, CEO of Walmart, complaining about people buying less groceries because of Ozempic, GLP-1s. Here's the sauce on that. Let me start by saying I don't doubt that some people are buying less groceries because they're on a GLP-1. But think about how many people are on GLP-1s, you know, as a subset of the population. Over time, more people will get on GLP-1s, and this will impact their bottom line in a more significant way. Matter of fact, hat tip to Matt and Sue the Dude. They've been way out ahead of this. They've been talking about this for, for months and months, probably because they already noticed that they buy less. But let me talk to you as a father of four kids, so family of six. We're not buying less groceries because daddy's on a GLP-1. Buying less groceries because I can't leave the freaking Walmart checkout without spending $400 and that lasts me like a week. Maybe, if I'm lucky, I don't have to come back in the week. But even then, we're supplementing somewhere. And check that, we don't even shop at Walmart. We shop typically at Aldi, cheapest place in town. We're not buying less groceries because daddy's on a GLP-1. Buying less groceries because milk is $5 a carton. Buying less groceries because I can't buy a package of raspberries or, or strawberries for my kids without spending five bucks. Also, I'm lucky to get home and have that stuff not be moldy. That pisses me off. Thank God eggs have come back down to earth a little bit, but we're paying four or five dollars a carton for eggs. So get out of here with this trash Walmart. I don't want to hear about it. These companies are going to have to juke if we're going to fight obesity. Absolutely, they're going to have to juke. But make healthier food. They're going to have to pivot but they'll still make their money. You're not gonna catch me shedding a tear over Walmart losing some sales. The powers that be in this country have managed this inflation thing so terribly, so terribly, and it's hurting families. For sure, let's play Mozambique.